The menace of land grabbing in the country has not spared the Kenya Broadcasting Corporation either. Its land at the Comarok station was yesterday the battlefield between police and members of the Comarok Housing Society after the latter resisted orders to vacate. <laughs> Police had to lobby tear gas at the protesters to disperse them from the land. The society claims to have acquired the land in 1981 and had subsequently subdivided it and sold it to its members. We are calling the government to intervene in this matter so that the members of the Comarok uh, Cooperative Society can be given back their land. Because they are posts erected by the KBC uh, to show that this land belongs to them, which is not true. And therefore, we came demonstrating because we want to be heard by even the highest office so that an intervention can be made. Kuna hiyo masamba siko pale, kila member alikuwa anaweka 100. Kati walikuja kupeka hizi post, sinasema KMBC. Sisi wana members atukuitwa. Lakini wakati committee imetuita leo kukuja tuelezewe hizi maneno ya hizi post wameweka. But government spokesman Cyrus Oguna had warned Kenyans against purchasing the land, saying the property belonged to the state. He has accused Comarok Housing Society of having acquired that property fraudulently. It was a similar situation in Mombasa at the KBC's 23-acre land known as VOK, for which land grabbers have over the years engaged the corporation in a prolonged struggle. It took the efforts of the ICT Principal Administrative Secretary, Eric Uraide, and the Coast Regional Commander, John Elungata, to set the record straight. They also directed the National Environment Management Authority to remove the illegal dump site on the land, terming it both a health and environmental hazard. Environmentally, you've seen it's very damaging, and we want the NEMA offices to take immediate remedial action, including taking someone to court, for dumping in an area not designated for this purpose. And I think it's serious dereliction of duty for officers to watch this happening. Um, uh, you know, while they are the ones responsible for ensuring that the environment is clean, I think um, we will take that up with them. The land is not available for, for grabs. Is not available for any other use. The Kenya Broadcasting Corporation and the government of Kenya have clear plans, present and future, for this land. But if anybody had a proposal, they would come over, we discuss the proposal, we see its merits and demerits, and see whether it is implementable or not, and how it can be implemented. But my enemies, this land is not available for dumping. For lunchtime news, from Mombasa County, I am Anne Buru.